These are the hoodies. They are $30. See what they're about. Check the other videos on the channel. And, um, gonna be speaking about headline topic. Um, they got anybody serving food today. This, this, this is getting too common. Uh-uh. Let's go. Let, let people get their inheritance. Keep their inheritance. If all they want to do is live in the house and sleep, let them do it. Let them do it. They have a woman in Vegas. She got there. And she spit up in somebody's food. Spit in somebody's food. There's also a headline topic about, let me see, what is this? Uh, Chinese health officials suspended after refusing to investigate forced removal of couple's baby. This is in the South China Morning Post. Somehow, Getty Images are the one that is the copyright credit for this here. It's a rural district in Gongzi region, and they had their seventh child taken away from them. Y'all, uh, who will first get into my child and cross reference with this here. The incident where the woman spit up in a customer drink. This is the Las Vegas Review Journal. I see the head. I, 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 I briefed the article, but it was on video surveillance. That's how she got caught in 2020 in the iced coffee. Felicia O'Neill is her name. And she just, well, oh, did she just, uh, this, this article was just written up within the last 48 hours uh, or the last few days. Oh, God. Just stop, stop putting these people in a situation where they got to do stupid shit like this, yo. And, oh, did y'all hear about the mayor A got uh, robbed there in New York City? Also, they did a report on a gap boarding school, a private Baptist Christian is up in Missouri. I need them to cover Massachusetts along with Shawana Sands Sodoma. This article, um, was written on Alternate by Alex Henderson. I, I don't know where my son is at this time here. Um, some people in the town had uh, posted it and were speaking about the agape being closed. I have not heard uh, anything from... Um, I have not heard anything from there. And they have some, well, they've been had this year, where your number can be used to fleece others. It's a scam that's going on. Um... I also want to speak about this old scandal with these housing programs. All they doing is trafficking. All they doing is trafficking information. And they're going to have to make a law that unless you've been offered the apartment, and the same thing with a job, which I've been was an advocate about that. If they're not offering you the job, they shouldn't be able to ask you your social security number. You know good and well, these are certain jobs that should be listed exactly what jobs. They don't need your social security number for Don't never contact you. They just selling that stuff on the dark, dark web and trafficking it. And then I tell you, well, you come back and get your copies. The information they didn't fool around and put up in their database and gave too much of, which include uh, that Citadel Realty, the girl named Yasmin. So somebody may pass across this here and come across. Uh, that uh Miss Humane Trafficker and they they gotta do an audit uh a audit petition on these old dumb ass caseworkers. Stop stop getting up being a fucking caseworker if you ain't fucking staying stuck and you don't have an immediate relationship and connect to secure funding, uh fundraising, 
uh, fundraising goals, if you ain't got that uh, Jim and Tammy Faye Baker in you, stop getting that becoming a case worker. Stop getting your 410C3, and then they get that and they steal promotions off of people such as myself, such as the one with the Hill Network. And I, I like I said, I spoke about that on other video, and it's going to be uh, one one all together. It's, a, it's, it's, it's so much to say, and so competing priorities to deal with. Stop getting no 410 C3. Stop being a case manager. You ain't got no resources. And all you're doing is uh, only dealing with matters when it's celebrity. That's it. When it gets major headline viral, that's the only way you're dealing with it. And then, and these are the same folks. I didn't help them get where they at. They're still in my concept. They're using one of the one that they hear network or Leah Holland. She stopped using the voodoo vaccines. But I had an article. Copyright in the publications, uh, which got it, it, it uh, LaShawn Allen Muhammad was the one that did the editing of it. That's mine, it's all mine. Uh, Voodoo Vax, that was the title of the article Voodoo Vaccine. It was perfectly edited. I'm the original concept and writer of it, LaShawn edited. Um, it was placed in this guy, I forgot the name of the magazine he had. Something odd must have happened. I, I talk about that on some videos back. It's, it's a lot to keep up, and it's really one of those things that if you ain't supporting, it ain't really worth repeating everything. Um, but his name was Will, and his girlfriend name at the time name was Taj. I don't know if they together, and I forgot the name of the publication. Um, somehow it erased off of the Google database. Very much to what they did, the archives of State of the Black Parents. Oh, it's a lot of folks. I got it. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's, it, it's beyond. Uh, we we going to see uh that, that male that got uh, the aide that got robbed. I'm sure she got robbed of her ID. We're going to see how quick that get replaced and how she's still able to get, go get services and forth like that. That's how they shouldn't play with the housing. And it could be somebody shook. They feel like they homeless. It don't even matter who it was. Well, is it? Does it? You're not securing the housing. You are an enemy of the people. You are an enemy of humanity. And did anybody get there and think about how these folks going to tell people to commit, to, to, to not commit suicide and continue their life, get mental health? It ain't, we, we know how. We know how. Stop asking how. It don't make sense. But then you won't get there and be pro, uh, pro-abortion. And I'm not taking neither side. Go ahead and have your abortions. However you're going to do it, crack it legal, you still do it. So I don't, like I said, I don't even speak on top like that. I really don't even want to speak on this side. But do what you want to do. I ain't nagging. Do what you want to do. However, you can't put it in nobody's food. You should be able to put it in. And somebody got there and it came back to me. Somebody got there and, 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 and they wish me call them. I, I've been talking about this all along. People go there taking stuff off of off, off my uh, watch, stalking the YouTube channel, stalking the interviews I do. I got hoodies and shirts for $30. You see, I, like I said, it did, and this is my phrase, this is my phrase, that bring that y'all use and come off a of return Jaguar. That's where that bring come from. That bring did not come from Saisha. It's spin off. Spin off. From Return Jaguar. If her child name, like I say, somebody, anybody go hack her data record, her IG records, or IG uh, history algorithm. If she first had her child name, like hashtag, or uh, the girl up in uh, Kansas, that got uh, killed by the police, or taken out by the police, and hashtag George Floyd. That's how she had her child name, and everybody else had their children name like that too. Mine has always been Return Jaguar. I never had my child Name is just his. And and then, like I said, on that June 24th, where you will see that she even named her, uh, her non-profit on my behalf. She ain't doing nothing on that uh, non-profit. I doubt it. Let me say I doubt it. She probably finding ways for, for, for the post, but I can't post anything. I'll be stealing all my timeline and claiming this 401c credit. But y'all going to have to order these folks that stealing concepts. Off of me with their 401c3, and they're doing just enough to steal off of me and look like they being some being workers and laborers, and they ain't doing nothing but stealing concepts off of me while I'm not paid. And then I get there and use me and my child, 
for a tax uh, a tax deduction. I'm telling you, that's what they what they, what's happening. Like I said, a lot of my get there, I give them personal data. Like I said, they probably got us on that dark web and stuff. But I get there and I rebuke and chaw y'all down and have the rods choke y'all. You won't get away with this. You're breeding all your herd, nor you. Get down, give them the information to get services for my child's uh, condition. And then they tell me it's still a process and procedure a whole six months to a year later. And they won't get there during this time and lie and say, I don't want to accept the services. Or I have to fool around and get there and teach them to provide services to my child. They don't know nothing. Nothing at all. That's one of the reasons why I went for the pursuit of happiness for the improvement of my child. And it was a total failure. You shouldn't have to do nothing. I shouldn't have to do nothing but show at the max my ID. But the same way you letting Ukraine people, when they get blown up in their houses, come here with a uh, blanket in, in their hand, the same way I should be able to get services with, with just me showing up. You don't care about you. No. Same way you letting those come over the border, the same way that we should be able to get services also.